Hello and welcome to PSTV, a series of special broadcasts telling you everything you need to know ahead of The Print Show, a brand new trade exhibition for the UK print industry. PSTV will be covering the big news and exciting updates in the run-up to the show taking place at the UK's top exhibition venue, Birmingham's NEC, from the 13th to the 15th of October. With a fantastic bill of big names already signed up to exhibit and the unanimous backing of all major trade bodies in the industry, there's plenty to shout about already. Organisers of the show held a pre-event press day in London earlier this month, where attendees got the exclusive scoop on what we can look forward to at the show itself. I get asked a lot of questions on our meetings as to what the print show is and in fundamentally it's a uh, UK focused exhibition, the first one we've ever done uh, as a business. It's located at the NEC, obviously two hours from pretty much every business destination. It's going to be focusing on all areas of print, whether or not that be life or digital, right through to from finishing to packaging. We're not sort of looking at any niche markets, we're looking at all markets. Um, so we're hoping that with the support of yourselves in the industry, we can put on an event that the industry wants. As the drinks flowed and delicious canapes circulated, guests were treated to a special roundtable debate with major exhibitors and the chance to experience the awesome Oculus Rift virtual reality technology. Brendan Perry caught up with some of the industry figures that made it along on the day. I think the print show is really, really important uh, for the UK. As we've seen, there's been a demise in events in the show, especially in the UK uh, since IPEX last year as well. But it's really, really important that the British printing industry all gets together um, in one place as a focal point for an event. And I really think it's important that there's a place to network and also it gives us the opportunity to give people a visualisation of our new product as well within the three days of the print show. I think the UK printing industry definitely needs an annual show that encourages information sharing and networking. Um, in an industry that is evolving so quickly, I think it's so important that businesses make sure they keep up to date with the latest trends and technologies um, that are going on. One of the biggest manufacturers present at the press day has been digital print juggernaut Rico. Gareth Parker gave his view on the strongest areas of growth in print and what the giant will be bringing to the NEC in October. What we see in Rico from our experience about the core growth markets in digital print, a uh, number of them actually. First of all, short run print work that's being taken over from certain lifeboat work, in particular for quick turnaround in 24 hours. That could include retail work, financial work, and also bespoke high quality specialised work as well dedicated brochures, personalised work, but, but way beyond just what most people would necessarily see as VDP or variable data printing, it's very much specialised packages around how a customer or recipient of digital print work actually accepts that work um, through the post, over the desk or however they pick it up. So it's the impression that it makes, is really the sort of style of work we see being really um, exciting for digital printers today. A final bombshell dropped by the print show's sales manager, Luke Stoneham, was that Conoco Minolta have signed to the event and will be bringing its latest technology. So, that's it for this special report from the print show's press day. But if I could leave you with just one thought, it's this. Print's back, baby. As Brendan touched on at the press event, Conoco Minolta became one of the latest big names to confirm it will be exhibiting at the show. After a fruitful meeting with event director Chris Davies and sales manager Luke Stoneham, the firm made the decision to not only sign up, but also to take the largest stand on the floor plan. Stoneham says the team are absolutely delighted to have Conacher on board. Show organisers had something else to be delighted about this week, with a record three signings in one day, adding IST UK, Print Vision Leicestershire and Adpac Machinery Solutions to the lineup. And coinciding with our brand new show, the NEC Group is preparing to throw open the doors of its new ultra-modern leisure complex, Resorts World Birmingham. It's hailed as the UK's first integrated leisure destination, Resorts World boasts an 11-screen cinema, a hotel with luxury five-star suites, a tranquil Asian-themed spa, a casino and an outlet shopping centre, all of which will be ready to enjoy as the print show gets underway. And that's all from this edition of PSTV. Look out for another update coming next month. And in the meantime, you can stay in the loop at theprintshow.co.uk. And be sure to follow the show on Twitter. See you next time.